ready. channel chrono pixel gaming we are right to game streamer and today we're playing a brand new game uh, uh full disclosure the key has been provided uh to me by a company called neo hive so thank you very much for that hey jesse cat so thank you very much uh uh neo hive for providing me for the key for today uh and uh, we, we're gonna play a brand new uh looks a really good game actually uh called miniatures now um what is miniatures so forget me notes because <laughs> my memory is all bad as, as anything um in good thanks for asking so miniatures is the collection of uh, strange tales uh where childhood imagination basically comes to life and merges with a dark undercurrent and there's a few mysteries and puzzles that we have to solve a little bit of magic thrown in there as so, well we have to uh, uh, explore a vast seascape build the odd furniture feed the lizard and play with sandcastle <laughs> uh, hey miss ginger and there uh, hey guys only here for a couple of minutes i just want to say hey you know thanks for coming in thanks for coming in I'm guessing you probably be at work, so uh, that that's absolutely fine. But appreciate you coming in. Uh, so yeah, we're, so again, so thank you, Neil, half for providing the key. Uh, this is from a company called Other Tales uh, Interaction. Uh, as I said, so we're gonna go straight into the game, uh, into miniatures. Yeah, see how see how we, see how we plays. I did install it. So sending you both positive vibes. Hope your day gets better. Messaging X Ninja, and that the concert is awesome. Low in sixty seven. Okay, so we're just gonna boot it up quickly, and then we're gonna get it on the screen for you guys. that should just pop up here we go just get uh, alicia up for us there is alicia up i 
two. Um, that's gone. Oh, well, thanks for the shout out, Cronus. No problems. Let's get this up. Uh, let me get me uh, other things up that I needed. So basically, uh, guys, uh, right, need to go. Love you all. Time. Thank Let's you for coming in. Uh, if you have that, if you're having your lunch, have a nice lunch. Uh, so again, guys, so uh, uh, came out on the 14th of November, so a couple of days ago. It was under embargo, so I've, I've, I, can, I can I can do it now. Uh, like I said, uh, a bit of a collection of puzzle games based on the child's imagination. It's on Steam. Um, now I'm streaming over to YouTube as well, so the links are in there uh, for the Steam page and Nintendo Switch. Uh, Four ninety nine. It is on Nintendo Switch, so it's absolute bargain. You can get it on iOS as well for two ninety nine if you want to go the mobile route. And on Steam, it's a, it's four ninety nine as well, but it has got a little bit of a discount on it as well. So very very affordable game. Um, uh, so yeah, it's going to be released on Nintendo Switch, Steam, uh, PC, Steam Deck, Mac, uh, Itch.io, uh, Itch.io. If you use that platform as well, uh, PC, Mac, Linux, and iOS. Uh, so yeah, it's basically a lot of a lot of different platforms uh, that it's gonna it's get it's got released on uh, as from the 14th. So very affordable. Like again, links will be in description. Uh, so if you want to go uh, look at that on the live stream on my YouTube channel, which out. is Chrono Pixel Gaming, you'll actually see the links for the Steam page and the Nintendo Switch page. I uh, you'll just type it in miniatures and you'll find it. Uh, I wish there was an Android port for this. If devs are you looking to, to post it over to Android, I think that'd be brilliant because then you've got it on all platforms. Because not a lot. I know. I know iOS is very popular, but I I. I think Android is right there, to be honest with you, nowadays. Like, I, I think it kind of makes more sense to have them on both platforms. Um, so, yeah, that's just my thoughts. And I don't know if it's going to come to any other consoles as well, if it's on Nintendo Switch and on PC. It might appear somewhere else soon, who knows. Um, but, yeah, we're just going to get straight into the game now, guys. Uh, let me just close that down. Close that now so we can see me chat. And um, here we go. Okay. That one. Ah, here we go. Miniatures. Oh, nice. A oh, little bit. Oh. So we got a little. So we have to turn on the light. We got a little box. We got a screwdriver. Oh, right. So these are the four different stories. It's comprised of four different stories. Uh, so each story has a distinct gameplay and an art style to it, and it can be played in any order. As I've just found out, I just clicked that one. So this is familiar. Uh, so as you can see, it's a very like. And then, so what did he say? That one and that one? Is that what he said? I was looking at somewhere else then. Okay, I'm guessing screws in that one. Yeah. We'll go on that one. No. About that one. Okay. Okay. We. Oh. Oh, we got our screwdriver. Need a screw. Put it in the hole. I'll screw it in. Get it off a screw. In the hole. No. Get it off a screw. In the hole. And then it goes. Okay. 
I'll see if we can hear him in the sound. Hold on a minute. Does it sound like a little bit? We got sounds. Okay. Um, I did actually forget to put my headphones on as well. Let me just get my headphones on my neck, guys. <laughs> Okay. Oh, oh, Swan stopped that. So, like I said, uh, yeah, so. Different art styles, uh, like I say, can be played in a different order. As you can see, it's um, more like we're having fun, and then someone's kind of stopping the fun. Uh, so there's, a, there's definitely like a little undertone here. Um, it's a full story. It's, um, we have to like embark on a journey of nostalgia, mystery, and thought provoking exploration. So let's see how we'll see what. This reminds me of me uh, making me desk uh, literally the other day. <laughs> the flashback. The bruises all over my arms, chats. I'm telling you. Just um, let me get my chat up as well so we can see my chats. Where's my chat gone? Uh, hey Jesse Katz. Where's my actual chat gone? There it is. Okay. Oh, oh. This is gonna be a wild ride. Uh yeah, love you, love you, enjoy. He's gotta beat he, he gotta beat down by the house, yeah. Oh, 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 no, it's my handle. No. Ah, uh, uh. uh, it's, it's my handle. No, no. Oh, Okay. Instructions, okay. <clears throat> you gotta flip it. You gotta flip I can see that from here. You gotta flip it upside. <laughs> They're gonna get annoyed here. You can you can talk out the chat. Oh, that music. Oh, <laughs> like that, didn't they? Like nah, no, I'm not doing it. God, this is so many memories of um. It it it's like that. I honestly I I don't, um. Hello, women, man, I'll tell you. I, I, I bought a new desk a few days ago. Uh, is it two days ago now? God, it's time flies. Anyway, I bought it. We have to move all the stuff so we can fit it in because it's a big, it, honestly, it's a massive desk. It's showtime. And the, the desk is, um, yeah, two days ago. And the desk, two people got to make it, but I've, I've, I've obviously made it all by myself. And the amount of times I got things wrong, <laughs> so following the instructions, I got the, the top wrong with the bottom twice twice uh i got the drawers mixed up the wrong way i was like oh god and what should have took like probably like two hours it's it took all day honestly it took all day oh 
I didn't mean to. This time really does fly. Oh, I didn't mean to do it. Oh, I did do it though, yeah. Oh. It's a sellotaper now. <laughs> because of screws. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing, what we're doing. Is it just gonna break? Is it just gonna break? I'm clicking, I'm clicking chat. I don't know what I'm meant to be doing. Oh, 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 I see it. Oh, I see it. See, so as you see your mouse, it's all white there. And then it goes, boom, look, see black and white there. So that's the interaction points. You need, I think you mean more tape than that, love. <laughs> Just nail it in. Just nail it in. <laughs> I mean, that's one way. Forget the screws. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Oh, it's not coming apart, chat. Oh, no. Wait, get it, get it, get it. Go on. Squeeze it all in. Just go on. Squeeze it all in. Come on, guys. All at the same time. Come on. Come on. Go on, and, 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 You got this chrono. Uh, oh, just about. Uh-oh. I hear it creaking. Oh, God. It'll be fine. <laughs> Just get it in there. So that was screwdriver one. It does say this is very sh it's short, so it's more like an experience. Like it's like I said, it's like uh, you remembering stuff of your childhood. Do you remember that one time when you you built that wardrobe with your family and you kind of got frustrated a little bit? So we'll go backwards. We we started off here. We'll go like this. Go around like in a, in a little circle. We'll go butterfly. Wonder if there's another layer. The house of the moon. Okay. It was someone with a particularly bright moon and a suffocating heat. It made everyone in the house lightheaded and soon the curious things started to happen. Overnight, all of the fruit and the lemonade disappeared. Oh no. I wonder who we it. Shh, I'll tell anyone, chat. <laughs> Wasn't me. <laughs> oh, I gotta scroll. Oh, okay. Then my mum. My mum, something. Then. Oh, oh. Hold on a minute. Oh, then my mum wrapped herself up in a blanket and slept for several weeks. Next, the moon landed in our garden with a loud bump. Just tell me if the, if the sound's overpowering my voice. Uh, I've just turned it up a little bit on the mic, so we should be, should be good to go. You're okay, okay. Stick on that note. Childhood memories are the best, even the frustrating ones. The sound finally woke Mum from a slumber. That night, she spoke with the moon for hours. Oh. It was impossible to stay awake. In the morning, they were nowhere to be found. Ah. 
We're on the case of the missing mum. Footprints lent me to a strange new trace. Some kind of dust. Dad did not want to hear my story about the moon or hear my new discovery by the water. Instead, he promised that mum would be back soon. Ooh, what happened to mum? I was not so sure. Mom, oh mom. A path, a small path led up. I searched for footprints, broken branches and dust, but I did not find any. Further up, there was still no sign of them. I'd really seen something in my binoculars. I love how it's like kind of like it's like kind of a picture book, isn't it? Like kind of like of them old pop-up books, but like kind of more interactive. But uh, just as I was about to give up, I found a little cloud of dust. Strange though, how did they get up there without any leaving any footprints? Put some dust in my pocket for closer inspection. That look like small fish scales. And then the light always reminded me of Mum's blankets. Why did mum leave with the moon? Did the moon have promised her something? Or perhaps the moon needed help. Oh. Got something far worse. Could have happened. <laughs> Do not know how long I kept searching for dust, but eventually I lost track of time. Suddenly it was dark, terribly dark. It was dark. It was terribly dark. <coughs> Found the island again. Is it even safe to continue at night? There was definitely something alive in the darkness. Wanted to go back. led me deeper and deeper into the forest. We go more up. Oddly, the further I went, the more light I saw between the trees. Ooh. 
excuse me. It was time to solve the mystery. Finally reached the house of the moon. Inside, everything was dimly lit and dust flowed through the air. Glasses were filled with wine, food spilled from the bowls, and a dental music played. She was not the same. In this house, her eyes closed, her movements were sharp, and her skin was pale. Somebody called her name, and I immediately recognized her voice. It was the moons. that then yeah guys there's no post and links in the in the chat uh, without my permission so uh exploratory rifle um i didn't even see you come in you didn't chat so you just tried to post on the link uh it'd be nice if you like introduce yourself and said hi and stuff like that before you try and post in links i'm guessing you have bots so that's why you got a warning and that's why you yeah you can't post link to my channel oh that's cool okay the glass is, is smashed now the horn go for the horn Do you remember the little people, uh, the ones that lived under the sea, under seashells, rocks and bottle caps? Don't. Unless you're talking about crabs. The Loft Bank Castle. Ooh. Do you know what? This, this right here reminds me of some game. I can't remember what it was. I think it was on, I think it was on Apple as well. But I asked, um, I can't remember what it was, but the, it's just the layout, the, just the uh, the style that sticks off it. And um, I can't remember what it was, but it was a point. It was a point click adventure game as well, but puzzle game <coughs> looked very much like this. Right, you got your drum. There you go, mate. Yeah. Oh, you're waking up. Thanks for the check ins. I will definitely stretch. How are you today, uh, Sangbird? Doing okay. Knock, knock, knock. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, he's waking up.
Not yet. Yo! Oh, is that, do you know what I've already just realized? We're in a big massive sandcastle. It, it did say that, didn't it? I'm, I'm so, I'm... It takes me a minute or two, guys. <laughs> I didn't realize. Right, what about you and this? He's got it. You're waking up. Hello. Yeah, you're waking up. Come on. Gonna put in one of these. No. Aha, in there. No. Oh, oh. Uh, I, I think it's this one now. I think the other one had one as well. I can't remember. There you go. Yeah, I thought so. go we got the band together now when we was having fun. Just need to, um, one minute, guys. There we go. Now I can see what we're, what, what's going on with everyone. Songbird. I see you redeems. I seem to be checking. Weird. Chrono doing some miniatures today, huh? Hopefully, it gets more lit. So, there's the pal paladranium. Sorry, I've butchered them words then. <laughs> paladranium. I don't know what even that means. This. Is it the same thing? Hell? Okay, so we're in a room. TV. A 
Okay, so we can interact with the TV, the piano, and the phone. Let's click on the TV. Got three channels. One talking up looks like about the, maybe the weather. Some maybe spaceman finding the crystal. Hi, mom. Uh, Emily. Hi, mom. Emily. Again. Again. What about that? What about that? Love you too. Let's get some subs in while the ads are running. Show some love to Chrono and the channel. Okay. So we're something about that. brewing spill the beans or should i say the miniatures that's a good one at least yes spill the miniatures <laughs> what's this uh, whatever that was we got it cup is it a cup i think it's a cup okay You don't want enough food? Okay, well we picked something up. I don't know what we picked up. Um See the slippers before. Right, so we got our shoes on our slippers. I like slippers off. Maybe sliders. Maybe the, the sliders. snails and for what reason I'm not too sure yet that's what the jar was for wasn't it okay I suppose we sit down for a minute just relax Anything else we can do? No. So we got the snails. Oh. Hello. Oh, stairs are just opened up now. Oh, it's that. You need help? I just have to untangle the wires. Then I'm ready. Oh, are we making that like an aquarium?
Thank you. Let's put it all together. This. It doesn't bite, right? Only if he's frightened. Oh, what does she got? Eight Hi, sales. Hugo. It's me. How are you doing in there? Your new home be ready soon. Oh. Quite a few lamps here. What is this one for? It's a heating lamp to imitate the sun. Hugo needs it to keep warm. I'm guessing some kind of lizards. Looks very scientific. My favorite plants are the bromelias. Their leaves are shaped so they can collect rainwater and create small pools. Mm -hmm. Some frogs use the ponds to place their tadpoles in. After some time, they jump out as real frogs. Oh, is it frogs? Fascinating. What would you call frogs? Oh, hold on a minute. All done. There we go. The aquarium looks great. Palibarium, Dad. You're right. What is a palibarium? I never heard of that word, palibarium. I would just call it aquarium as well. Well, that's a palibarium. Hmm. Where did it go? I think he's hiding. <laughs> Snails, Such a eh? curious creature. I hope they don't slime the whole I aquarium. Like Check on our polybarium in a minute. Let's have a look. Hi, Hugo. Are you hungry? I caught your favorite food. Mom and Dad had to stay late tonight. But you don't mind. What the hell is that? Oh, that's all I knew. I said that there was a lizard. Maybe an iguana? Something like that? It looked like maybe like an iguana. Oh. Oh. Asteroids. What am I to be doing? Oh, okay. This way. Let's try sleeping. Interesting the last time. Even though it's like bright daylight. No? Okay. Anything else? No. No. Check this again. To did I miss something? No. 
No, I didn't. This is a bit of a weird one. Oh, what the hell's going on in here? the parents been gone for In, in the Paladarium or whatever it's called. Oh, you can move between the scenes. Is it like a maze? I'm not too sure. this kind of thing. Oh, look. There's a memory box done. Is there more? Very short. We've just completed that in World well, Ups. The set. The timer says 50 minutes. That was really short. It was very interesting. I, maybe there could have been another layer to the box. Maybe so a couple of more memories to make it a little bit longer. I mean, I mean it did say short. I didn't think it was going to be under an hour short. Very interesting. It's like, it's like, it's hard to explain this one because it's like a um, puzzle point and click kind of like uh, an experience, some kind of like, um, like, like you're in a dream kind of thing um very stylized more like a like a graphic novel uh, or visual novel if you want to call it that um very definitely very interesting what so what's that um, what's that what's the box the 
box just carries on. Oh, okay. Is, is it? Is this, is this the same thing? It's the same thing. Okay. <laughs> All I can say is, uh, again, I, 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 it, hey, it, it was miniatures? short. Why are they so fascinating? Hey, good afternoon, uh, Supernova. Um, we'll probably be switching over to another game then in a minute. My thoughts on the game. Uh, um, we're just we're kind of like reviewing the game. Um, yeah, weekend went well. We've just been given a game by... Um, uh, it's just a review we've just been reviewing it then or playing it as well um yeah it's a, a bit of a, a bit of a strange one uh, again i thank to neil high for providing the key uh to have a look at and play and review it again it came out uh, on the 14th it's around about three pound on on a uh, steam and on nintendo switch so if you're into like your very like surreal point and click adventure games kind of like um kind of like it felt like you were in a dream for half of it i i i think i preferred the first puzzle thing with the family that was actually pretty funny well it was actually interesting as well how they kind of like started to kind of fight over uh making this uh like wardrobe and you know what i mean it's like ripping up the instructions and they're getting frustrated and we've all that we've all had them moments i'll tell you that and um, the moon one i didn't hey, really understand but I, I presume that like the mum just like went somewhere for a time and so it's like the child kind of um uh, you get you make up stuff when you're a kid don't you this is the thing to get over traumatic events you you make stuff up you make it sound like it's a lot better than what it was and then only when you become an adult you actually realize oh my god i can't actually believe that even happened well yeah you were so young you your way of dealing with it was to basically say that your mum went to the moon you know what i mean so there's that there was kind of that undertone kind of aspect to this game where they was kind of tell your story and um, i think they've done it very very well to be honest with you yeah deep and emotional yeah take two is really good for that it kind of tells your story within a story and within the gameplay this is not as long as take two take two is like a couple of hours long this was let's say 50 minutes long i i enjoyed some of the puzzles in it um so the puzzles were very i wish there was more i think that's what i'm getting at like even though it says it's a short story and um the four puzzles four stories i just wish that maybe there was a bit more maybe there was another underlay off the memory box so there was eight puzzles maybe just uh you know uh thing or yeah but i did enjoy it and that's the main thing i did actually enjoy it so for the 50 minutes i got playing that on an ios for for like you know, two three quids i don't mind paying that to be honest with you you, to, you know uh, just as a little casual game something that you can enjoy and uh, something that's like yeah it might actually help you as well um with like w whatever you're going through you might might actually hit 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 something and go oh god yeah i need to talk about this i mean that's what these games are really good at doing and uh, without you even realizing it might hit hit a chord you might and then you yourself might actually go oh yeah do you know what i i actually remember something uh that actually did affect me when i was a kid or something like that. I, I couldn't quite process it at the time so it kind of made up a story you know what i mean so or you made something up so you, these games are kind of good for like kind of access in that back memory that yeah that most people have to be honest with you but again yeah thanks to neil half for providing the key uh again go to my youtube page and every, all the description and all the links uh for the steam page and the nintendo switch page if you're interested in the game are on there again this is not a paid review they just provided the key uh so again i i really do thank you i'm gonna go on a five minute break and i'm gonna go i'm gonna i'm gonna do a new stream <laughs> uh with, with um with a different game i'm not gonna i'm not I'm, this is just a separate stream just for neo hive because i've got to provide uh as well uh a, a copy of the vod so again thank you very much for neo hive i i i 
th this was amazing that you've given me the opportunity to review this um again i would highly you know if you if you're into little miniatures you're into little puzzles you're into nice little storytelling and it's not too long um and you want something to play maybe while you're on the bus going to work just something very very nice um yeah and it's got like a message behind it i, I think this is definitely the pickup for you again uh, the links are in my description if you go to my youtube channel which is chrono pixel gaming uh, same as on twitch uh, you can watch the vod as well they'll all be uploaded and you can watch the video and you can watch me live uh, so go over there go over here and everything will be in the, the description for you click on the links you can go there and you can buy the game it's totally, completely up to you uh, again thanks to neil Har for providing the key um yeah i'm, I'm just going to finish this stream uh and I'm going to start a new one in about five minutes time guys. So go and get, I'm just going to go and get some food, a uh, quick, quick break. And then I'll be streaming, um, probably, uh, the game that was playing last night for an hour or two. So again, thank you very much, Neil Hive. I look forward to working with you in the future. Uh, I, um, I'll post uh, all the links out now and again thank you for giving me the opportunity to uh, review the game i do review the game <laughs> you know it's a, for me i just wish that there was a little bit more i, I thoroughly enjoyed the game is it worth the price yeah yes it's worth a couple of quids um you know is it some triple a blockbuster game obviously not it's just a nice casual friendly game that yeah it's it's got a nice story to it it's got a nice pace to it it's very stylized very artistic and like i said it's more of a visual kind of a graphic uh kind of book if you if you know what i mean uh and yeah so give it a go anyway guys uh my name's been chrono this is my channel chrono pixel gaming uh and we'll be back soon so see you later guys bye